Welcome back after this beautiful and gorgeous Tuesday afternoon and evening. We are going to see the heat begin to return into the area. Mid 80s what we're going to be tracking for our Wednesday, partly to mostly sunny skies. It's our first step forward toward warmer weather. Thursday we're going to head toward 90 degrees. It'll be hot and muggy at times. A late day storm threat Thursday evening into Thursday night clears out by Friday. We turn briefly a little bit cooler Friday and into it Saturday. Enjoy the cooler feel that we have right now. If you got those windows open, you're going to wake up to a really nice feel tomorrow morning. Upper 50s and lower 60s. We're all going to end up in the 50s overnight tonight. Not quite as cold as what, what we felt this morning. And did you feel it? If you're an early riser, we were back into the 40s, mid to upper 40s for the majority of the area. Very chilly and cool for the month of June and mornings like this are going to be something of the past as the heat is going to be headed into our area. So where is it right now? Parts of the desert southwest, the Four Corners area. That's where they've got the big heat. They've got excessive heat warnings in effect. And what's going to happen over the next couple of days? The big ridge in the jet stream, that heat dome is going to shift to the east. And by the time we get toward the end of the weekend, and I'm talking Father's Day, that heat dome is going to sh set up and expand over the eastern seaboard. And once it arrives here, I'll tell you what, it is not going to be going anywhere anytime soon. Hazy, hot and humid weather going to fill up much of our 10 day forecast. We're highly confident this is going to be a widespread area of above average temperatures. It will be likely as we go through the next 7 to 14 days. So what will be the impacts when this is going to arrive? We're going to flip that switch right as we go into mid June and beyond. The impact is going to be for 90s for multiple days. We may be talking day after day after day. And what you need to know at this point, just be prepared for some hot weather and have plans to seek some shade, stay cool, the sunscreen and hydration just to get you prepared for the upcoming heat. It will start on Father's Day right around 90 degrees, hot and humid feeling conditions. So enjoy the cooler step out the door tomorrow morning. We are going to start tomorrow morning back briefly in the mid to upper 50s. Highs into the afternoon we will reach into the mid 80s as we go into the afternoon and highs. I expect even warmer by Thursday. Now, when will our next chance of rain be? We're going to be dry all Wednesday. Thursday, we're going to be mainly dry as well. Through the afternoons, the heat and humidity builds. Late day, isolated showers and storms will come in Thursday nights and into early Friday morning. What to expect for tonight? Partly cloudy skies, slight chill into the air. Mid 50s will be expected with that sunset this evening. It went down at 9.08. For your Wednesday, mid 80s, mostly sunny skies. We're going to turn warmer. It's our first day. We head toward a warmer conditions in that 10 day forecast. We're going to be right around 90 as we get into Thursday and muggy conditions. That chance of a storm will be out there Thursday evening, low 80s into Friday, Saturday close to 80 degrees. And there it is the heat humidity that will pour into the area Sunday, Monday, Tuesday of next week could reach toward the mid 90s. And that feels like could even push toward 100 degrees. That's look at your 10 day forecast. Jeff.